Greetings all you beautiful people of YouTube. I'm George aka Pops and Blades and today I want to do a Christmas haul video. Christmas 2018. Uh, we're going to blaze through everything because it was... I got a ton of stuff and there's going to be a lot of stuff you didn't even see in this video like uh, a tool chest that I got, uh, a slam ball which is kind of like a medicine ball but you work out with it a little bit different. And um, some other odds and ends. My wife got me some socks. Uh, but I will show you some of the shirts that I got. So, got a Deadpool shirt to start. That's from a friend of ours. Actually, her 13-year-old daughter. My wife got me this Star Wars looking shirt. Best hubby in the galaxy. She and I both agreed that I needed some husband related shirts. Then, uh, my wife also got me, uh, this one says, I never dreamed I'd grow up to be a perfect freaking husband, but here I am killing it. Then we got, also from my wife, Stark Targaryen, make Westeros great again. Love this shirt. That's funny. Also from my, from my wife, uh, Fleece, Fleece Navidad. Love that. I think that's funny. I'll wear that more than just at Christmas time. And last but not least, shirt was, my wife got me, I'm your Huckleberry. Because we say that to each other. And I needed another brown shirt. I only got one brown shirt and we both agreed I needed at least one more. Alright, next up from my, when you hear me say my uncle, aunt, or cousin, it's on my, my wife's side. So from my uncle, I got this drinking stein from the Texas Renaissance Fair Festival. And this is actually their 1980 release stein. Every year they release a new stein. And I was born in 1980. Sorry guys, I got my dog in here with me and he's barking at nothing. But, uh... From the year I was born, 1980, I haven't decided if I want to use it to drink out of yet or just leave it as a display. Sure is nice though, either way. Uh, let's see, so from my cousin, we got a Predator accessory pack. And right above my head, over in this direction, somewhere at the top of this shelf, I have the Bone Throne. I want a couple of... Um, Predator hounds, a couple of different predators, and a butch to, or I'm sorry, a, a Dutch, to kind of make a nice shelf of predator stuff. I don't need a lot, but I definitely wanted the accessory pack, and I was glad to get that. From my father and mother-in-law, I got a Galco holster out of the waistband for my Ruger LCR 38 Special, 38 special Plus P. Uh, let's see. From my... From my mom, uh, Silent Night, Deadly Night, NECA figure, which I was really glad to get this because honestly, as much as I wanted this figure, if we'd have got past Christmas, I probably wasn't going to get it. I wanted this figure because at Christmas it just was the time to get it. Maybe I'm weird. Uh, let's see, what else we got? Uh, from the same friend, friends who got me that Deadpool shirt, I got a 5 movie DVD set of Dragon Ball Z. This has Dead Zone, The World's Strongest, Tree of Might, Lord Slug, Cooler's Revenge. I think out of those five, Cooler's Revenge may be the only one I've seen. But this is my first Dragon Ball Z DVD set, and they knew that I want to get all the DVDs, which is going to take some doing. Uh, my wife got me this very cool item. This is a coffee thermos with a built-in coffee press. So I cannot wait to give that a go. We'll leave that out, out of the plastic. Uh, what else we got? I'm trying to get stuff. There we go. Excuse me. I got my wife and I both this HD car dash camera. Pretty cool. It's got a lot of reviews on... Uh, 
Amazon. There you go. There's a specifics if you want that. Very cool item. Um, if you look at any of the YouTube car crash videos, everybody should have a dash camera. down there oh yeah my wife got me this awesome little leather uh, penguin coin pouch just because she knows how much I like penguins and she also knows that I really like uh, artisan stuff stuff made of wood stuff made of leather and yeah that's cool I dig that I don't I don't know if I'll use it or not just because I don't want it to get ruined uh, let's see. Okay, so from my mom, we got a knife from Silver Stag. Now, I have always, always, always wanted a Silver Stag knife. I'm going to do an unboxing, of, of an official unboxing of this knife later, so I can show what all came in the box, but I just want to show off the knife actually you know what i'm not going to show the knife off i will just show you this if you want to see the overall knife you'll have to check out the knife unboxing video beautiful knife though absolutely gorgeous uh let's see okay so from my wife we got a kaiser knife and the model escapes me at the moment but uh, here that is. Uh, the model is something that, that starts with an S. It is a discontinued model. Great knife. I'm going to do a review of that knife as well. We got a pair of Bluetooth earbuds. I have opened the box, but I haven't actually opened the earbuds themselves yet. But this was something off my Amazon wish list. So, I already know I'm going to like that. Another item that I'm going to do an unboxing and a review of. Yeah, we may do a review. Either way, we're going to do a first impressions unboxing. So, I'm not going to open it. But, uh, we have a copper Olight flashlight. Olight makes some great, great flashlights. I've had several over the years. And I think I still have a couple as we speak. Another That was another item off my wish list. Alright, so that's everything in that box. I tried to get everything ready so that I can make this video. Uh, a luggage scale. A food scale. Two items that I definitely needed. We got a SS Georgie FYE exclusive blood splatter. Uh, die cast boat. This will be coming out of the box. This is a ex uh, convention exclusive, but I will be getting a second one to leave in the package, probably to display on the wall. But for now, it's going to come out the box so it can be right up there. Also, FYE exclusive Funko Pop and shirt combo of Pennywise. This is, yeah, this is a black and white uh, pop. These are still available on their uh, website, I do believe. So just type in Pennywise Pop Tees and it should pop up. Uh, another thing you're not going to see is I got one of those photography light boxes. It's not the biggest one. I want to say it might be like 28 inch or something. It's something that once I get this table cleared off that I got everything up on now, I can have it on one side of the table and then I can do videos maybe on the other side of the table. So that's still in the box and over here on my side. We got some books. Some of them are fiction, categorized as extreme horror. Uh, I have one in the car titled Survivor. Then we have Party Games by John Athan. Uh, let's see. The Good, the Bad, and the Sadistic. Yeah, this is still fiction. Same author, John Athan. And then The Basement 
by R.J. Parker, Ph.D. So these are categorized as extreme horror, very graphic. Um, as you can see, neither one of these three are very thick books. But I'm definitely looking forward to reading them. The book I have in the car, Survivor, is almost 400 pages. And I'm about halfway through it in just two days. Very good book. Next up, we have three more books. These are more true crime. We have Killer Clown, the John Wayne Gacy Murders. This is a pretty solid uh, overall book by Terry Sullivan with Peter T. Macon. Ed Kemper, True Story of the Co-Ed Killer, True Crime by Evil Killers, Volume 2, Jack Rosewood, author. Not a very thick book, but I like that because that tells me it's going to get down to the meat and bones of the story. Next we have titled Deviant, The Shocking True Story of Ed Gein, The Original Psycho by Harold Schechter, author of Bestial. So Ed Gein is also loosely what Leatherface was based off of, Leatherface's character. So I can't wait to get into that. Uh, so what do I get? Six books total? One, two, three, seven books total. Uh, I got this necklace that I'm wearing. Uh, black onyx beads. Um, cinnabar dragon pendant. And cinnabar beads as well and then for myself i bought myself a pair of shoes once i finished christmas shopping for everybody those are pair of shoes i've been wanting i've seen them in macy's really really been wanting them didn't want to pay the 150 dollars uh price tag that came with them but through online shopping during the holidays there's always sales really good sales these shoes went down to half price so uh, there are a pair of dress shoes, which I do not have any dress shoes. All my shoes are either tennis shoes or boots. So I needed also a pair of dress socks, which I went and from my local DXL. I got these Robert Graham dress socks to go with the shoes. The shoes are Steve Madden. They are a size 13. And these things are just absolutely... Fantastic. I love them. Check these out. Is that not badass? <laughs> I love it. And these shoes uh, came with some extra whatever you want to call these studs or whatever in case any fall off but the inside is just amazing with that wine maroon color very cool i dig them they may not be for everybody but they are most definitely for me so everybody that is pretty much what i got for christmas like i said there's other stuff you didn't see um i almost forgot I got some candy items. I, my wife and I got a bunch of camping and backpacking gear from various people. Um, yeah, I think that's really just about everything. So let me know what you guys thought. Um, at some point, we're going to be doing the knife unboxing of Silver Stag. We're going to do a knife review of both knives that I got. An unboxing first impressions review of the Olight Copper Flashlight. And I have a couple of unboxings that I need to do and get this table cleared off so we can do those. So, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you thought in the comments. If you like this video, I hope you will give it a like and maybe even subscribe. So until next time, everybody, I hope you're all doing well. I'm out of here. Peace.